Guys, it's now Monday. It's a bank holiday. It's the first of June, I think. Well, I didn't make a video for a long time again. Uh, it's been a little bit special now in the world because of this COVID-19 virus. I guess everybody noted this. Noted is noted it. Um, yeah, I don't want to say too much about it. I just want to say that I hope everybody is fit and well. It was not the best time of, of life. I was actually lucky. I was in Norway here, and didn't hit us too well, too hard. So I should not complain too much. When that is said, I decided one week before the COVID-19 COVID was hitting hard that I will not do any racing this year. The reason why is because my Cupra is too old now. I, will, I would need a new one. I don't have budget for that. I was for a long time speaking with Avdi Sport in Germany. Thanks to them, they was actually offering me a good deal, but I didn't manage to to make it happen. So I decided to take one year break from from car racing and focus on the workshop. Try to make it more finished, you know, so I can easier make money in the future there. Because actually, I feel the last years, uh, yeah, I have the workshop is half half ready. Where I'm living is not the best place, and yeah, so everything I've been 50%, you know. So I don't feel my mind have been fit enough to, to perform on the level I want in motor racing. So hopefully when I can manage to do more at the workshop done now and make the other stuff in life better, I can come back stronger than ever. So when that is announced, I think it's time to tell you guys that I'm organizing my go-kart now. <laughs> Because go-kart we're gonna do, we're gonna drive a lot of go-kart. Stay fit, you know, stay fast. That's gonna be really good and good fun. And when I'm not doing go-karting, I'm doing roller skis. Oh damn, it looks like I have tits. I don't, I'm actually fit now. To straight up a little bit more. Um, yeah, I have some movies from the last two months. It's not fitting really good together. It's random clips with a lot, lot of times between them. But this is what I got. Hope you enjoy it. And yeah, this was maybe not a really funny start of a movie, but I felt I had to tell you guys. So enjoy. Hope you hope to see you guys soon. Hello. I need his Aldo plate now. This one is 100. We're gonna have it 84, so you're gonna take away 16. 16, there we go. Perfect. Then we're gonna have 68.5. Plus 02 because it's minus 02. And then let's see if it's fitting in this hole. It was fitting, so I put the glue and I put the plate inside. There we go. Only the glasses left, but I'm gonna wait with that till I made some uh, closing support and stuff inside there. I'm at my sponsor place. See you soon. Hello, Ole! Boys is making uh, an oven. Can't you explain me what this is? Oh, this is a furnace. Furnace? <laughs> yes. I thought it was an oven. Ah, it's an oven. It's an oven. call it a furnace. You can make your pizza. <laughs> <laughs> you can make many at once. Morning guys, it's 5 o'clock in the morning, I'm in the Sprinter, I have the trailer on and we are going to a place called Sannes to pick up a crash at Carabot. Sannes is a couple of hours away, 8 actually, one way, so uh, yeah, that's the plan today. I just arrived, 7 hours at least, that's the car I'm going to pick up, the white Vito there, a little bit damaged, it's going to be good, time to get the keys, load it, fly back home. Like I said, it's seven hours from home to here, but now I have the car on the trailer, so I can go even faster, you know, because now I have much more grip in the corners with the trailer. It's not going to slide so much now. I think we're going to do it in six, six and a half. That's going to be good. Look at this country, there. Norway, snow in the mountain, and the sun is out. 
Hi, it's beautiful. Norway is beautiful. It's a uh, powerful. It's a curious thing. Make a one way week. Make another one sing. I was late home yesterday, then yesterday was the day I picked up the car. Car is inside now. Don't have too much damage actually, I can drive it in and out, so it's a good project. I made some changes here the other day also. Cleaned up a little bit. Now it looks much, much better. And I also on the outside of the paint box, I put these cover lists around the windows. So now the the paint box outside looks much better. <laughs> Hello! This is uh, Thomas Hauge, the biggest bonde here in uh, Fredrikstad. Huh? What did you just ask me, Thomas, if I have pølser? No. You making a ball? You are just uh, feed the grill. <laughs> you are just fire up the grill? <laughs> That's the grill. Jeg visste ikke at det var sant hans i dag. Lørdag var i dag og sant hans i lårdag. It's Saturday. Jon is around the corner. We have a lot of projects today, but one of them is to remove this... Hello buddy! To remove this uh, million stones. Because this trailer, hanged Anninga, is going to be parked here later on now, hopefully. And the reason why we're going to move it from there to here is because now this spring my plan is to take this this box off the chassis the chassis is going away it's for sale but the box we're gonna have down on the ground and I'm gonna have it for a storage so we're gonna move it now then we're gonna prepare the ground here make it flat and straight and lift this box down there all right then I need a piece of a mirror a thin one I got one this is down in the basement at the workshop. This one we take. We do actually here at work have a storage with a lot of different mirrors, pieces and stuff. But everything we had was too thick. Then I started to think, hey, where can I find a thin piece of mirror? And I was thinking maybe down in the basement the old uh, toilet there. There we got this one. It's now off the frame and I have this one. Diamond cutter for glass. And we have a split, now we're going to cut it out. Now I made a line, then we are dipping this one in the split, and we're going to cut, I already cut a little bit here, but I'm going to cut like this, like that, and like that. Normally now then I can, should be able to do like that. Then we have this piece, now we're going to make a new line of the exact piece we're going to have. And since I'm drawing on the outside here, I have to cut a little bit inside of this uh, line now. Because I made it a little bit too big. That's a normal problem actually. Be careful now, so don't cut my fingers. I made it exactly. This I draw it out now, too big. I'm not sure if I'm going to manage to take away that short, small piece, but we try. Okay, let's see now if it's coming off. Oh la la. And... Uh, Voila! We got a new mirror. It's finally time to bring new car to the painter. To the painter. No, they are mixing color. Though. Yes. I said earlier today we're going to bring the car to the painter, but painter today. That's me. First of all, I got to paint the parts. All righty then. Look at this other glossy and shiny and nice. Uh, it's nice painted. Natural talent. Natural talent. All right. One layer on the car is done. Now, time for the second one. And the car is done. It's done. It's painted. It's white and nice. This is a good and a sad day because it's the first of May. I sold this printer, we are actually going to the airport to deliver it now to a customer who is going from north of Norway. But I sold this one too, he bought two sprinter from me. This is the one I used for my races the last couple of years. So I actually have a personal relationship to this one, you know. Now we're going to do the last 
last trip with it. So I don't know which day, this is May. It's a beautiful day. I'm here with Jale. Jale, say hello. Hello. We have just been going 34 kilometers on roller skis. So that was a good ending of the day. I just sold the beam doubler. I didn't sell it now. I sold it earlier this week. And uh, now the guys is leaving with it. It's always sad to see a car go away. Dennis, where are we now? We are at Varna Karting. Varna Karting. We have been testing go kart here today. Somebody is testing something else here as well. Oh. How is it going on else? I'm at my sponsor place. Did you take our glass? You know, this Corona times it's not so easy to get sponsors, eh? But I called her to ask if they can help me with a front window to the Vito, and they say, of course, no problem, we fix it. That's a great sponsor. Oh, come on! There we go, I got it. We are ready for the new glue. Tommy is an expert on this. Window is inside, and now we're gonna calibrate to the camera. Tommy and I is now 100% done, so I say thanks a lot to Hurtuluta. Now we're gonna spin further on. Fin Marcus, uh? hey. doing well? Yeah, I'm fine. Look at this. Look at this view, guys. This is Hurtuluta. So that... Looks beautiful. Eh? Huh? We need an ice cream for this view. <laughs> <laughs> ice cream? Where yeah. that fitness you bought, Mike? No, no, ice cream. No ice cream, I can't afford it. <laughs> we are just done with intervals running in this beautiful weather here today. Today is it really, really amazing. And now I'm just going to stretch my beautiful legs here now. And then we go back home. And hey, I didn't show you guys, but the wheat I picked up in Sanes is ready. I'm driving it now. And here it is. Looks good, eh? It's actually already for sale. My buddy Abdu just arrived. You're going to the honky soon for ice cream. In this one. <laughs> 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 for well. I got well. <laughs> this is what we call uh, real hot road. Real hot road. Yeah boys, now are we actually back to the day I made the first movie, it's the 1st of June. Yeah, the first clips I made here when I did roll the skis, this is earlier this day. So now we are back till today. How are you doing, Finn Marcus? I'm very fine. It's so nice here, beautiful. Yeah, it's actually really beautiful. And it's not many days since we was here earlier. Now we made movie then too. Yeah, three days ago. Three days ago, yeah. Yeah, the movie we made last time was on the top of this mountain and down. Now we are completely down with the water. Today is a good day. Today we are Drew William. Yes. And with this ball bag again. Last time it was on the mountain driving on the ice. Now we're gonna drive here at Ruskogen on Oswald. I'm actually gonna be helping him today. I'm gonna just look at the data on the computer and tell him to where to go faster. Uh, did your father put diesel or petrol or petrol petrol on the car today? Diesel. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he didn't do that today again. He didn't. That's good. Hey, Vin. Yeah, that, I mean, that was my question. Is it uh, benzene or diesel on today? <laughs> Fuel. <laughs> Fuel? No diesel? No diesel. You learned from last time? Yeah. Oh, that's good. <laughs> yeah. Looking good. Evin, yeah. I have a question. Yeah. What the fuck is this? 
det er lyskroner. Lyskroner? Ja, det er ingen sis. Bare teltet. Kan du det? Nei, jeg har ikke dette i min tent av slight. Det er virkelig gøy, egentlig. Det er veldig nice. Nei, det ser ut jævlig ut. Det er skinngud. Så, vi er ferdig for i dag. Happy i dag, Marius? Jeg tror det var en god dag. Du hadde mye utfordring. Du og Dollar Marius hadde mye utfordring. Det er bra. Jeg har også måtte vise dere den hvide BMW jeg bought ikke så lenge siden, med side damage. Det står der. Det er ferdig. Det har vært ferdig for en tid, faktisk. Det ser bra ut, eh? Det var ikke så mye damage på denne ene. Det var faktisk en easy fix. Det var damage på denne siden. Og denne siden er som ny nå. Denne kar er faktisk en gammel taxi. Det har 280.000 km. Men når du ser på det, vi har ingen sjanse å se at det har så mange kilometer, for det er faktisk i veldig bra stand, og eierne tidligere har tatt veldig god kjære av det. Så det er forholdsvis bra, sammenlignet med når du tenker på kilometer. Og jeg har også måtte si at det ser ut som en M3, men det er en 320-diesel. Så det ser ut som en fast, men det er ikke. Vi har også måttet å bruke trailer nå, lately. You can see it was standing there earlier, now it's there. Now we're gonna remove a lot of this gravel. Make it straight as the asphalt. And we're gonna lift uh, the box down on the ground. And I'm gonna have it as uh, lager, what's that in English? Warehouse? Storage it is, not warehouse. Storage is the name for it. It's a new day. Yesterday we had a digger here, big uh, grab machine. We removed a lot of the stuff we had to remove there. As you can see now it's a little bit lower, now I'm gonna put the duke and I'm gonna start fill it up and make it completely straighter. That's actually not an easy job and it's a lot of job. So guys, thanks for watching! This mid work is over now! And thanks for all the new subscribers, amazing! See you guys soon!